Okay, here we have the original footage. Basically, how this video is going to work is we're, I'm going to display the original footage. Don't worry, I will announce it. And I will say what we basically did in each shot, sometimes even in the original video. For example, uh, here we can see it's not a really happy atmosphere because it's the raw footage. Nothing is actually happening because, well, it is raw, you know. And uh, this is not the effect which we actually wanted to create because we wanted to create a very, very happy effect, a really an effect that is happy, you know, that portrays the character's happy mood. As you can see, it's a bit dull. And then here we have played around with the offset, gamma, gain, contrast, shadows, highlights. Basically, this applies for every scene which we shot. You know, it's just this happy, really happy atmosphere which we wanted to get across. And I think we definitely managed to do that you I mean come on the colors are also nice they're all happy you know like really orange sort of you know it just portrays the character's mood which we as i said already wanted to do and then you can see it's much more happier much more ten exciting you know he's preparing for the party and then here we are, we have the Nye, it's a bit more, and then here, it's the original footage again, as you can see, we shot a day for night, basically, it's a light scene, where you have lots and lots of light, and you just make it dark in um, the editing process. As you can see, it's again the raw footage, as I said already earlier, you know, we just have the protagonist <laughs> just randomly, basically, uh, staring into emptiness, you know, it doesn't look haunting, it doesn't look sinister or anything else. Basically, what we did for the dark shot, we increased the blue output a bit, shadow highlight, gamma gain offset, you know, just made it all a bit more darker, a bit more sinister, just a bit more scary, and we really wanted to portray this fear for aura you know it's happy and it's suddenly fearful it's suddenly not a place you want to be for the torch we use the mask application to just track it so that it still blinds it you know just adds to the haunting because you can actually see shadows in the background you know and they you don't know what whether or not they're real or not and then here is the original footage again as you can see it's not really as scary basically what you will see what we did in the edited version we just decreased the curves gain gamma blue output a bit more it just looks a bit more dark and sinister and you will uh, just uh, it looks maybe you know it's still the continuation of the fearful aura and basically this is what we want to achieve because initially it's as I said already, it's happy, and then we can see here, we've really reduced the background light before it was really, really bright, now it's all shadows, you know, we wanted that because you don't know, is this now him walking towards the monster, or is it the shadow of the monster walking towards us, and then here you can see nicely dark, scary is much more highlighted, it's not comedic, it's, it's actually scary, and then basically, as I said already, blue gain offset, you know, we just played around with that really, really create this fearful tension uh, building up you know this is really the climax of the scene because he just run, tries to run away from monster here we have the original here we have the four dead friends in the background basically what we did for these friends is that we used a mask application to track them each and every one of them and you will see in the video to follow that it's basically really really dark and scary and then here for the singer, we this is the original one. Here we have the text. So basically what we did for the friends was that we outlined them, put all the colors down so they have a nice black and white effect. Basically they look like ghosts with that and that's what we wanted to achieve because they did, you know. And then here we have the fearful expression again, scarier again. You know, I'm just, I'm just going to repeat myself. And then here we use the video application to just zoom in the title and me bleeding out and then we just uh, decreased the shadow and highlight for the singer but just to make it a bit more dark haunting and sinister and then at the end we just used the black magic design because initially it was one of the requirements okay thank you very much for watching